Group Discount is a paid add-on for the WP Travel Engine plugin that lets you provide a group discount based on the number of travelers booking a trip. This add-on does much more by allowing you to set a discount range for adult, child, and other groups separately. In this video, I will show you how to install and configure Group Discount add-on on your travel booking website. Let's get started. First, you need to log in to your WordPress admin dashboard. Now, navigate to Plugins and click on Add New. Click on Upload Plugin. Click on Choose File. Select the Group Discount zip file that you received in your email address. Then, click on Open. Click on Install Now and click on Activate Plugin. The WP Travel Engine Group Discount add-on has now been installed and activated successfully. Now, you have to activate the license key for the Group Discount add-on. Go to WP Travel Engine and click on Plugin License. Now, enter the license key that you received during the download of the add-on. Your license key looks something like this. Click the Activate License button. Your license key for Group Discount add-on is activated on this side. After activating the add-on license, you will receive regular updates from our team. Now. Let's configure the global settings of this add-on. To do that, from under WP Travel Engine, go to Settings, go to Extensions, and go to Group Discount. Here, you can define different settings for the add-on. First, you can enable or disable the Group Discount for all of your trips. You can disable or you can enable it with the help of the toggle. And after you enable the group discount, this option will be available for all of your trips. Then you can add in the group discount info from here. If you don't like the label that is already here, you can remove it. Then add in the label of your choice. Now click on save and continue. Now let's go to one of the trips created. So we will go to trips and Go to all trips, let's open it in the new tab. Then let's go to the first trip. Click on edit. Scroll down and go to pricing and dates. Click on edit pricing and dates for the package that you created earlier. Or you can also add a new package. I'm going to use the package that was already created. So click on edit pricing and dates. If you open one of the categories, here you will find the option to enable or disable the group discount. Let's enable the group discount. Then you can set the group range you want to provide group discount to. If I set 1 to 5 here for example and set the price per group as 1000, then the next row will automatically start from 6. If I set 6 to 11 and set a different price here, let's say 1500 for example, then the next row will automatically start from 12. Let's set a different price for the last row as well. You can also review whether you want to set the pricing type as per person or per group. Let's set it as group for now. You can repeat the same process for enabling child and other categories discount options. Click on save and close. Let's open the trip in the new tab. And here you will see the label that says group discount available, which we put at the beginning from global settings. If you want to change the label at any time, then you can go back to the global settings. Then select a different group discount info label. 
let's go back to the trip. Now if you're visitors, click on check availability and they try to book a trip. Continue. They will see that the group discount is now shown for the adults. The pricing and also the other related information that we added earlier is displayed here. If you apply the group discount to the child or any other group you add here, it will be shown for the other categories just like how it is showing here. Now because I have set the price per group, if I increase the quantity from here, the price will remain the same. Had the price been set per person instead of per group, the price would keep increasing as you increase the quantity. As soon as the quantity crosses 5, the amount shown here will be different. Also, as the quantity crosses 11, the price shown will be different as well. The amount shown now will be as per the price per group you set from your trip page. And if your visitors proceed to check out, the amount will be shown accordingly. So there you go, this is how you can install and activate the group discount add-on on your travel booking website. If you have any queries, please do let me know in the comment section below or you can reach out to our support team. I have added the link to creating support ticket in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in our next video.